Are there specific types of speakers for different types of music? It's really, for me, an odd question, but it's discussed a lot. And, you know, I hear, I hear people, you know, on audio forums and things all the time talking about, yeah, it's a great rock speaker, but it doesn't do jazz well, or, or it's great for quiet classical music, but it doesn't rock out if you, you know, put something with some heavy bass beat on it. Now, why this is strange to me is, a fundamentally well-designed good loudspeaker is a good loudspeaker, period. If it's a neutral design, it's going to sound good with anything you throw at it. Not a specific type of music. Any, any music genre that you decide to play is going to sound as good as the original recording. And here's the key. A good neutral loudspeaker that's well designed will show up flaws in a bad recording. And unfortunately, there are lots of bad recordings out there. There are also some spectacular recordings. And it doesn't matter if we're talking about rock, classical, jazz, punk, EDM, whatever you want to talk about. There are good recordings and there are bad recordings. And I find it very strange that often People will, you know, associate uh, bad sound from a recording with something that the loudspeaker or their audio system is doing wrong when that's not necessarily what's happening. Now, you know, it's when I hear people talking about, uh, you know, a good classical music speaker, but it doesn't do rock well, I right away think about the technical things that could be going on, you know. It may be to have a slightly tipped up high frequency that sounds nice on classical music with strings and things, gives an ethereal open quality to the sound. But when you put on a badly mastered rock recording that's bright to begin with, it might blow your head off. So that's one thing that I think people are talking about in that case. The other thing is dynamics. When I hear somebody say, yeah, that speaker is really good uh, if you listen to small ensemble music or jazz trios or jazz quartets, but it doesn't do, you know, big orchestral classical works or rock music properly, I'm going to bet that there's some dynamic limitations in that speaker. Maybe it's not comfortable either from producing a lot of distortion or resonances or whatever, playing at louder levels with more complex music. But again, this is a technical aspect about the design of the loudspeaker. The opposite I hear is, you know, uh, a speaker that uh, for is, is good, said to be good for rock music. Maybe it's a little toned down on the top end, so it, it's not going to sound so bright and so thin. Uh, maybe the, the woofer section is tuned a little higher in frequency to give you a real good bass punch but maybe it doesn't have great extension. So now when you play that speaker, you play jazz or classical music on that good rock speaker, maybe it's a little bit dull sounding. Maybe there's not good bass extension and it sounds boomy on those things. But again, this is all tied to the loudspeaker. You know, I, I know that people have their preferences. And again, I never ever am gonna tell you what you're hearing or what your preferences are. Your preferences are just that. If you like the way a particular speaker sounds on rock music and you only listen to rock and nothing else, just pick that speaker. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. Be aware, though, that if you put on other recordings and it doesn't sound very good, there's probably some technical problems with the design of the speaker. This is one of the reasons I always suggest when you're additioning new audio equipment whether you know you buy from an online company like us and do a trial, or you go to a dealer and listen to your uh, listen to a piece of equipment or loudspeakers, I always recommend playing different types of music. Maybe even play something you don't think you're going to listen to because tastes change over time. And again, a well-designed speaker will sound as good and as faithful to each recording, whether it's good or bad no matter what type the music is. It's a total misnomer to suggest that 
well, that's a rock speaker or that's a jazz speaker or a classical speaker. What I see in those cases are speakers that are just not well designed. A good, well designed speaker is just that and will do excellent on any musical material out there. So I hope that answers that question for some of you that you know, use these terminologies about that's a rock speaker or, or whatever. Thanks a lot for watching.